Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel, welcome to a new video. Jonah is crying so we need to get out and go. Mum life. <laughs> but we're at Ikea. <laughs> Oops. Hey. Where are we? Oh. <laughs> what are we doing? Is that Auntie Nicole? Hello. Where are we? <laughs> <laughs> He looks so blonde. <laughs> I know. He's, he, he just looks like he's he got blonde He looks really fair, yeah. Oh dear. Oh dear. Come on then. We'll put back, you in here. Back in the bed. Yeah. <laughs> there you go. Oh no, he's got my hair. <laughs> <laughs> well, <laughs> oh, he's a good boy. Good boy. <laughs> what are you doing, <laughs> yeah. Look at that one. So cute. Good boy. Took you in in this little one. Yeah, there we go. Leave that there. That's it. That's Baby it. burrito. Bye-bye. <laughs> so we've just come to Ikea. Jonah is now happy in his pram. Did I lock the pram? No, it's okay. It just feels really heavy because just I've got those. <laughs> it just feels really heavy because I've got some shelves to return and I've put them all underneath the pram. And now it feels really heavy. But I've never done a return to IKEA. I don't know where to go to do it. No. Oh. Oh. Oh my god. Because okay, I haven't got my glasses on. I was like, what is that? What is it for? One for sorrow. Oh. So you have to. Don't you have to break? You have. You have to break this. I think. Me? Yeah, someone you're with. That's it, and then I do it to you, I think, as oh, well. Okay. <laughs> I don't know. I felt a bit weird. <laughs> so many things at IKEA that you just don't realise, like this recycling station. I've never noticed that before. And then that. Um, did you read what the sign said yeah. for the sensory hour? Yeah. Or day? Days. Accessibility yeah. day. Yeah. Lowered lights and noise. That's such a good idea, isn't it? And when did they did it say when they do that? First Tuesday of the month. Oh, there we go. That's nice, isn't it? I just noticed all this garden stuff first in. I've never really thought of IKEA for garden things. I really like this. Sun lounger, Sigur Owen. It's nice. I like the little woven detail at the back there. It's cute. Oh. <laughs> Nicole's got Jonah, she's off. <laughs> this is really nice, this pergola. I think this is what we'll be doing, something like this in our garden. I've been sharing a few updates over on my Instagram if you want to go and have a look over there on my home account. That's really nice actually, I'd never thought at all, I don't know why, but I'd never thought to look at Ikea for garden things. And we've got furniture, lights, Everything in here. <laughs> here she is. <laughs> oh, I like this table as well. That's £150 for that table. I think that's really good value to see how big it is. I don't like the sheen on it though. You don't like the sheen? Yeah. The finish on it? Yeah, I think that's quite nice. You get like nice wood and people like glazing. It's nice little plastic. Oh yeah, I know what you mean. Yeah. I know, sorry, but... I've just seen this, celebrate midsummer with food. I did know that IKEA do some like random events like this, but they're basically doing a three course meal and an ABBA tribute, it's like a family event. Well, I might have to come to that. <laughs> Take myself a little flyer. So we've both got some meatballs. Wanted to come and grab some lunch first. We've got meatballs, meatballs, coffee. You can get free tea or coffee if you've got an IKEA family card. Monday to Friday. Monday to Friday. <laughs> and you've got spark <laughs> You've got sparkling apple. I got sparkling lemonade and a dime cake for dessert. I'm gonna sit, look over Sheffield. <laughs> 
And we actually on the way in as well spotted some people that were doing like some remote working. I think that's such a clever idea because I'm pretty sure Monday to Friday the IKEA um, tea and coffee is unlimited if you've got your family card. So cost of living crisis. <laughs> so yeah, some people have got the right idea coming and doing their remote working in the restaurant here. No, that is really small. Yeah, it is. It's really nice and quiet as well today. I've never been mm. midweek. So, it's peaceful. It is peaceful. We're gonna have some lunch and then go and see what we can find. Hello, cheeky. Hello, cheeky. <laughs> Hello. <laughs> is that funny? Is that funny? Hello. Hello. <laughs> Boop. <laughs> Boop. <laughs> It's a good little display, a complete living room for under £500. What do you think, Jonah? Hey? Mm, I do like that lac coffee table. That's just £22. That's such a good deal. I did want to get a smaller coffee table as well for our living room. I like the shelves at the back there. Can you see what... They're the lac wall shelves. Yeah. Oh, so right. I guess they're the big version. Oh, yeah. I just haven't seen them in this colour wood, I don't think. Yeah, the lac wall shelf in the white stained oak. Oh, they're really nice. These new armchairs are nice. I like the black faux leather one. What's this one called? <laughs> Ekan Asset. Hmm, it looks nice. That would be a nice feature in a room where you've got a lot of neutrals. Yeah. Like in my house. <laughs> a coffee table is nice as well. Yeah. I like this little space with all the plants behind the sofa. It's an interesting idea. And then, which one? The one in here? Yeah, I like that as well, that is nice. Skogs da 449. That's good value. Imagine this little design split in the middle. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I don't know if it was two tables at first, but it's not, is it? It's no, just no, one. Yeah. It's been a while since I came and had a look in all these little rooms like this. I just think it's crazy though. Playroom. Oh. How cute is this little setup? I just realised, look, it's like eggs. Yeah, and they put all the baking stuff out. They are good at this store, aren't they, for doing the little... What do you call it when you, like, style... Like the window dressing. Yeah, like the, the window dressing of it. The... Yeah. There's a... Um, what do you call it? The people who do it, though, there's a... Like the setters? I don't know. Yeah. A specific word for it. I saw it on Selling Sunset recently. <laughs> no, it's not that. It's the person who comes in and they just set it, ready for a buyer yeah, to yeah. look at it. Yeah. Suits you in there, Nicole. <laughs> yeah, these are nice, but it's just a shame that they're plastic. I've been looking for some soap dispensers that are just black. I mean, they're only £2, so it's a good deal if that's something you're after. I just don't know if they feel a bit, a little bit flimsy. It is a bit, isn't it? Ooh. Ooh. Oh, they've got tiny toys. Oh, baby ones. Oh, I've seen these before. They've got the tiny little sea ones. <gasps> oh my oh, god, they're oh. right cute. What do you think to these? Ooh. Oh, they haven't got the big bear. Where's he gone? There you go. Where's big bear? There you go. Ooh. What's this? Ooh. What's this? Ooh. Wow. <laughs> you seem lucky with all of this. Wow. No, it's all like kind of glowy, isn't it? 
so cute. Oh, the teddy bears. Wow. <laughs> oh, he's loving it. Nicole just found this polar bear called Snutig. How cute is that? Oh, This is just one of my favourite parts of Ikea. All the cuddly toys. I just kind of want to get all of them. <laughs> We've got some nice... Oh, I see. So you can have it like that or like that. Yeah. Is that right? This just seems like a major... Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah. But that I really like. That I would ah, do with it. Yeah, that's fun. Yeah, then got a play area underneath. Yeah, as well. I like the turtles on the wall. Yeah, that's on. a fun idea. Oh, and the whale holding the towel. Mm. That's cute. And see, I think Jonah likes the lights. Yeah, I like the like jellyfish lamp. Ooh. Oh yeah, the jellyfish lamp. Ooh. <laughs> oh. Oh, that's interesting. Oh, that's cute. I like that. Little pull out that. wardrobe. You, know, you can kind of see everything. Yeah, that's a good idea. The Smastad children's storage combination. Cute. Yeah. There's a lot going on in this room for me personally, but I think they just set them so nicely. Yeah. Oh, and they've done these features everywhere, haven't they? Like this one is a complete bedroom for under, under 500 pounds. Oh yeah, this is a pretty one. That's right, underneath my vanity dresser shelf thing. <laughs> I was thinking about getting one of these trolleys and then putting some baskets in it and then having my hair products and hair tools in it. Yeah, so I think that they would fit. I might have to just double check sizes at home before I buy one, but I thought that would be a nice way to just keep it. Oh, a bigger one. Yeah, yeah that, those ones are 35. Oh yeah, and then these have a lid for them. Oh, they're nice. Might have a look at the sizes of those. Something satisfying about these blankets being <laughs> arranged by tone. Mm, I like that. Well. Oh yeah, on the back wall as well. Oh yeah, all the way back there too. Very nice. <laughs> Yeah, that's pretty. Say hello to fresh summer vibes. Nice. And just come down to the marketplace. Oh, this is a nice little entrance, isn't it? There's actually only a couple of things that I need down here. I need to get some black photo frames I think for our bedroom <laughs> and I also need to get Grant some little tubs that he wants Nicole's just found I might get some of these as well actually because Nicole's just found some pink um, what do you call them marigolds washing up gloves like the brand you know yeah how much are these the Rinnig you get two I think I might grab some of those as well I love this section here all the like rattan and woven bits and bobs. <laughs> yeah, so this is the mirror booth. And it is literally a booth full of mirrors. Yeah. Is he woke up? Oh, he's just woke up in time. You're not sure about it? Have to do this one. Yeah. Wow, is this baby sensory? <laughs> What is it? Is that fun? Wow! <laughs> He's actually just staring at the ceiling. <laughs> He's not seeing anything. <laughs> wow, is it bright? Okay. Wow! Oh my gosh, he's so cute. He's so cute. Oh, that's a cool light though. Like, I know, it's a bit of like a random thing in here, but it's yeah. fun. I always like to like look in here. Oh, the actual light, sorry, yeah. yeah. <laughs> I'm looking at everything. Oh. What do you think? Wow. <laughs> wow. 
Definitely don't need any candles today. That's one thing I don't need. But if you are ever in the market for candles, we've got such a good selection here at IKEA. Several hours later, <laughs> we are done. <laughs> I'm going home. The sun is setting. The sun is setting. <laughs> we've got a lot of good bits and bobs that are there. I didn't really feel much towards the end because I had my hands full until I found a random basket. Oh, but I will show you what I got when. Oh, that's what? So I can take a table and a half out. Oh, let's see what there is in the last bit. Well, yeah, I'll show you what I got when I get home. Did you enjoy IKEA? <laughs> <laughs> so cute. Mm. <laughs> you are. <laughs> so cute. <laughs> so cute. What's this? What's this? <laughs> 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 dum dum. <laughs> <He's> so funny. <laughs> There you go. You want that one? Good boy. Oh. Oh. <laughs> so I'm back home now and I think we've been there for like four hours. We were there for ages. I didn't realise just how long we'd been there. But yeah, we had a really good look around IKEA and a lot of and had a good look at all of the new bits and bobs that are in store, didn't we? Yeah. And Jonah did so well, bless him. You were so good, weren't you? I think he liked looking at a lot of the stuff because it's kind of baby sensory almost. Oh, you don't want your blankie on. Okay. <laughs> um, yes. So I thought I'd quickly just show you the bits that I picked up. Um, and I found some really good pieces. So the first one is this. And I've seen this before a couple of times and I've always liked it but never really known what um, what I'd do with it or where I would have it but <laughs> but I found this in the I think they call it bargain corner now so I found this in bargain corner and it is a memo board with pins beige um, and it normally is 17 pounds but this one was just £10 and I think it's because the pins are missing. It doesn't seem to have anything else um, wrong with it. But it's basically this nice big pin board and it is like that on the back. So you can mount it on a wall or you could prop it up. I think I will mount it on the wall in the guest bedroom which I'm now using as like guest bedroom slash my office because each month I do a calendar for all of the content I'd like to create and I try and keep those up to date and planned out in advance and at the minute I just blue tack them on the wall but I thought with this I'd be able to just pop them on here and it'd just look a bit nicer and it would save the wall from the blue tack but the fabric is like a linen and then behind it it feels like it's got um, a bit of a foam board type thing so you could probably DIY and make this at home if you wanted to. Yes. <laughs> so yeah, I found that and picked that one up. And that was, like I say, just £10. And then I got three of these square black photo frames. And these were £5 each. These are the Nopang. Nopang. That's what these ones are anyway. Um, and my plan is I'm going to have them in our bedroom I think between two of our windows and I'm going to hang them vertically like this and I'm going to print some of our wedding pictures and um, some of the black and white ones and have them in here I thought that would look really nice and um, quite minimal and simple but a nice little detail so that's what I'm going to do with these oh and then I found some more um, vacuum bags so this was £3 for a two pack of vacuum bags and it breaks my heart but Jonah has now grown out of some of his like brand newborn 
bits and bobs so i've been getting those i've been getting those put aside i've been getting those put aside i've been putting those aside ready to be put um into storage now and i'm going to pop them in one of these vacuum bags and then write the age on it like baby boy not to three or whatever and then i've got a big storage bin that i'll pop each of these in as and when he grows out of um an age of clothing then i got a new pair of washing up gloves and this was just a pound for one pair <laughs> yeah um yeah can't go wrong really a pair of just washing up gloves for a pound and again for a pound i just got some of these kitchen clips and we use these on things like um frozen veg when you don't want all of it to fall out all over the place each time you use it so you get six in here for one pound and then grant needed me to pick him up some of these clear pla clear plastic bins so i got four of these and lids i think it's um i think it's something like one pound fifty for the box and 50p or something for each lid so i got him four of those and if you need anything like these clear storage bins, IKEA is really good for them. They have a huge range of different sizes and different shapes. If you wanted something maybe that was like longer and thinner to go under a bed or on top of a wardrobe, they've got a really good range of different sizes. I've got loads of these in the past from there just to keep things organised. And that's everything that I got. And you'll have probably seen at the start of this video that I did do a return of some shelves that just didn't look right in our dressing room which was where I was planning on using them and um, they were still in their original packaging and I believe as long as it's within a year since purchase you can return mm. it to any IKEA store <laughs> is that funny mm. <laughs> um so yeah it was really simple I just went to the return station near customer services and super straightforward and easy so yeah if you ever do need to return anything it's really nice and easy but yeah that's everything that i got i hope that you enjoyed coming along <laughs> with us to ikea today and please hit that like and subscribe button if you did and we will see you in my next one bye <laughs> bye <laughs> bye <laughs> bye <laughs>